GB News published a poll on Twitter which asked viewers if the newly unveiled statue of Princess Diana at Kensington Palace looked more like the Royal or Theresa May following several messages sent into the show. With nearly 4,000 voting in the poll giving both answers an even split. Some viewers attacked GB News saying the poll was insensitive to Harry and William who were commemorating their mother. While some viewers thought the statue's likeness of Diana was off, others refrained from being overly critical out of respect to the brothers. Speaking on GB News, host Simon McCoy revealed there was a lot of criticism following the statue's unveiling. The presenter added many more were saying the opinions of Prince Harry and William were what mattered most. Following the email, GB News put a poll on Twitter asking who does it look like more with Diana and Theresa May as the options. The votes were fairly evenly split but comments beneath the poll had some royal fans up in arms over the survey. One wrote, It doesn't look like May at all. If the boys are happy then we all should be too. Another commented, I think people should remember these two men lost their mother at an early age. The trauma of having to walk with their mother's coffin in front of the world while maintaining their emotions must have been devastating for them especially Harry. I'm sure they bear the scars. One viewer wrote, The statue looks great and shines a light on family values and caring for others. However, while many rushed to defend the statue and Prince Harry and William there were also some who criticized the artwork. Some called the statue horrible with some stating Diana should be alone without the children by her side. One said the statue could have been far worse and referenced the bronze statue of footballer Cristiano Ronaldo. The statue of Diana was unveiled at Kensington Palace's sunken garden during a closed-off and quiet ceremony. Public attendance was not allowed and much of the world's media were denied access. Prince Harry and William were closely watched by royal pundits for any sign of reconciliation or tension following their rocky relationship over the past year. The brothers unveiled the statue together, created by sculptor Ian Rank Broadley, which represents Princess Diana with three children. Harry and William published a joint statement on the day which read, Today, on what would have been our mother's 60th birthday, we remember her love, strength and character, qualities that made her a force for good around the world, changing countless lives for the better. Every day, we wish she was still with us and our hope is that this statue will be seen forever as a symbol of her life and her legacy. Thank you to Ian Rank Broadley, Pip Morrison and their teams for their outstanding work, to the friends and donors who helped make this happen, and to all those around the world who keep our mother's memory alive. Many royal family members, such as the Queen, Prince Charles and Kate, the Duchess of Cambridge, did not attend the event. Sculptor Ian Rank broadly released a statement ahead of the unveiling. He said, Diana, Princess of Wales was an icon who touched the lives of people right around the world, so it has been a privilege to work alongside Prince William and Prince Harry on this statue which commemorates her life. We wanted to capture her warmth and humanity while showcasing the impact she had across generations. I hope that people will enjoy visiting the statue and the sunken garden and taking a moment to remember the princess.